This is, you know, the, the housing first initiatives that have been coming out of, you know, the legislature in these different areas have been proven not to work, right? They, they're living in this imaginary world that's like the individual that's walking down the street have, suffering from a mental health crisis, that's self-medicating with heroin and living in a tent in an abandoned parking lot. They're just an affordable home away from their life, like being put back on track and being normal. And that's not true, right? That is not true. What's true is, is that we need to get into pre, you know, um, um, preventative services. We, we've got to, you know, help out the mental health, the health issues that are going around. We need full wraparound services. You know, the, those are, it's more government, quite frankly, that comes into that, but it's also propping up our local nonprofits and faith communities to be able to get involved in that. But, you know, one thing, you know, you hear some of my, you know, my practical ideas that I'm introducing there, that's because, we, you know, I, I understand prevention, but we got a problem right yeah, now. It's 